Mr. Chairman, I have a great deal of affection and respect for you. And I came here just to vote on these nominees. But after listening to some of the comments, I have to be honest, I feel compelled to say a few words. Happy. I had to laugh uh, and I chuckled, maybe a little too out loud, but when you said, uh, welcome my Democratic colleagues to the health care debate. <laughs> I uh, remember sitting on this committee during the whole process of the Affordable Care Act. I remember before that a group of Republican senators, many from this committee, working with Max Baucus, the former chairman, for months trying to come up with a bipartisan effort on health care, which ultimately didn't succeed because it didn't seem to be a real intention to try to achieve that goal. And then I remember sitting through countless hearings and a markup that was a marathon in which many Republican amendments were offered uh, and some incorporated. So uh, that's far from welcome to the health care debate. Now, uh, I, I find it amazing that what we have is a process that is going behind the a back room door, which will pop up at some point, have no, no review by this committee, no hearing by this committee, unlike all of the amendments and all of the hearings that went into the Affordable Care Act with a piece of legislation that affects the lives of millions of Americans, millions, uh, and, and many who are challenged in terms of their health care. So I, I have one point of concurrence with the chairman, and that is we do know all what's happening here. We have, uh, like lemmings, going over the cliff blindly uh, in a way just to fulfill uh, a political uh, promise, but not to actually improve the health of Americans. So uh, we've been uh, at the debate. We've uh, shed blood to try to make a system that is far better. We're ready to deal with more to improve it, but we are willing to do so in the way in which we created the law, which is open and public and with debate and input. So whether you were for or against, at least the American people knew what they were getting.